All right, welcome everybody. We are back at it again with our live streams. Let me get my stream set up. Make sure audio is working. Okay, audio sounds good. I have chat pulled up now. All right, let's get going. We're gonna hop right in to our ranked duels here. Let's grab our missions. We're playing Eldritch still. Still trying to perfect it. I've been playing it consistently now, but I still have a, a good amount of misplays that I feel that I should correct. Let's hop into it, gold. We're gold four after being reset. We were plat five. Hopping straight in with Eldritch. Just got a no name. I'm gold five player. Mm. Might do my first couple games with Blackwing. Just to get something different going. Let's see how this looks. Hmm. Oh, great. I just played against this deck. This is not a fun matchup for me. Not at all. Yep. What are the chances? Here's the last deck that I played last night. And I. <laughs> and I end up drawing the same deck here. What are the chances? So he's going to be specialing a lot. I wish I had a Maxi in hand. Well, I actually don't even have Maxi in this deck. He just passes there, so... I'm assuming he has some duds then in his hand. Because when I played against this deck yesterday, there was constantly things happening on his field. Okay, so let's do this. Set four. Go five. Six. So this banner's no six. Let's look at our six. Top six. Oh, Maxi. Oh, that's fine. Because we're not even going to special anything. Oh, that's perfect. Hmm. Summon limit or torrent or tribute here? I think I think we go summon limit I think summon limit is the play here so you can go get El um, Eldritch with this we have two ways to remove so we can pitch the lava golden for one of these we have an example, but so if we have this, we don't need summon limit. So we're not gonna need summon limit. So I think the play here is to go. Dang. I would assume it's one of these. Um, I think torrential. Um. Let's turn to tribute. See, he's gonna know I have it in hand. Just fine. I was hoping to hit an Eldritch on that, but I didn't. So, we're gonna set one. Set two. Three. Um, 
set four, leave Tori in hand. Pass turn here. It, man, I probably shouldn't have took the torrential tribute. I was gonna pitch it. But I think this is probably the best play here. Okay, so he's gonna reveal. So in response to that, I'm gonna go Vanny's emptiness. It's gonna affect me, but if we chain emptiness, so if we go, so we're gonna go uh, emptiness, so he can't special. Before that, we're gonna do our special to get our RL Lich and hope that he doesn't have a super poly. Or something like that. You know what, let's do this as well. So let's pitch our Lava Golem. We're going to banish his uh, Diviner. Now he, he doesn't have a Tuner on board now. Oh, he just scooped. Let's go, bro. We shut him down. Easy victory. I think he knew that he was kind of screwed there. Once we cut off his special summons... I, I don't think he was going to do anything. Plus, we we're, we're going to get our our Lich out, and that entire deck revolves around special summoning. Let's go. Hop him right back in. We're going for probably the next two hours or so, maybe three. I didn't even see the turnover. Bro. There's only two Lava Golems in this deck. Why am I opening with them back-to-back -back games? It shouldn't be happening. It really shouldn't. What is this? Oh, are we playing against an Elder's deck? Hmm, <laughs> this is gonna be fun. Okay. Three traps. That's fine. Prosperity to start. He has no responses to it. The six cards I just banished are cards that I keep in my deck, literally just to banish them. And we hit El Lich. Imperial Order. Hmm. So we have a Paleozoic. Do we go our Lich here? Pitching like a pitching Scarlet Sanguine. Popping his Lich, being unaffected by trap cards. Well, well by card effects. Do we add our own Lich here? Or do we go Imperial Order? I think we go our own Eldritch. And then we can just return in that order. Now with our own Eldritch. So we can pitch this and our Eldritch here since we can activate this from our graveyard. So we're going to pitch that as well. Um, we're going to send his Eldritch to the grave. Yeah. Let's send his, his Eldritch to the grave. He can't have counters. He does have counters, though. So he, he does have a response to this, potentially. I don't have anything on the field, though. So if he does, um, his Hakero just specials a creature. Won't be able to do anything with it, though.
Fanny's emptiness. So that's saucing from Special Inn. And that's the whole way that my deck runs. You know, Hikaru. Is he gonna banish my Olich? I think that's what he's gonna try and do here. And he opened up a pretty good hand. So he has to destroy something here, so regardless. Unless he clicks no, because of, yeah, I did click no. So this is gonna be a tough matchup. It really is. Well, we did get rid of his Eldritch. He stopped me from playing mine. And he banished mine. But we destroyed his Vanity's Emptiness. We got rid of his Eldritch. But at this point, it's Paleozoic, Tori. We have our Conquistador. We don't want to give him a Lava Golem. Um, actually, we probably could just to get rid of those. But he wants those in his graveyard, so he can go add cards to cards to his uh, field. So, do we Lava Golem here? I feel like I shouldn't. Like, okay, so let's let's Lava Golem here. Cause he's gonna do it anyways. So send us to his grave. Let's lava golem here. That way he takes a thousand. We can target lava golem, pitching our, our lava golem for this. At the same time, special in these. We do have Tori as well if he does summon a creature again. So that doesn't really hurt, I don't think. Let's let him take his thousand damage. Let's see what we can do here. So he should just try to attack here. If he does, we will Paleozoic it. Getting rid of it. I think we're good here. I think we're in the driver's seat just because his vanities he ended up playing. I think it's gonna end up affecting him pretty badly that he got rid of it so quickly. Um, you know, this is tough. Because we have Paleozoic. Do we save it for the Eldritch or do we? Yeah, I think we have to save it for the Eldritch. We might have to take some damage from that Lava Golem, but we'll see right now. Actually, when it's summoned, we'll just Tori, and then we'll Paleozoic his um, Eldritch. Yeah, that's what we'll do. So on summon, we're going to Tori into Tributes, destroying the Lava Golem. And now, when he moves to attack, we're going to Paleozoic his Eldritch. Banishing it. So now we're going to Paleozoic. Banishing his Eldritch. It can be destroyed by card effects, but it can be banished. I'm not going to activate that yet. Paleozoic pitching our Lava Golem. He will get a, a trap card. Um, Golden Land Spiller Trapped. He gets a set one. Guardian of the Golden Land. So what is this one? Hmm. 
Hmm, so I haven't seen this one. I, I don't use that one in my deck. Guardian of the Golden Land. Let's see what he's gonna do. Probably gonna pass turn here. We got the thousand damage off, off the Lava Golem. We pitched our own Lava Golem. We don't have anything to banish in our grave, which kind of sucks. We're gonna hold on to our Conquistador just because we want to try and get our Eldritch out for it. That's the only reason why I haven't used it yet. We're hoping that we hit some some kind of trap card here that, that helps us out. Or a Reasoning. A Reasoning would also help us out a lot just to filter some traps into our grave. And he gets a Elixir, so, he'll, so he's going to have a... Um, an Eldritch Golden Lord next turn. Then he gets a just special. Should be a very close mirror match. Should be a long one too. Another way to special. That's graveyard only. And a freaking lightning storm would be perfect here, right? Oh, Imperial Order. Um. Wow. Well. Not much to do here, except that. And we'll pass turn. Um, does he activate anything? So he, he can't activate the spell. Because it's only from hand or graveyard. Can't activate that though. So we're gonna chain to our Paleozoic. It's in our grave to get a just to get a defender out for this Eldritch that's coming out. We're kind of in top deck mode. I want to hit a reasoning. I really do. I, I think reasoning puts us in a driver's seat if if we can draw it here. Because he's gonna have Eldritch out, which sucks for us. But, um, so we don't want to do this yet. Not yet, not yet. Give us our Paleozoic, put in defense mode. This changes, um, one creature's attack to zero if Eldritch is on the field. This special is Eldritch from the grave or hand. Hmm. Kind of in a bummy spot here. Not much we can do. So he's gonna draw. We we need to hit a pot here, honestly. We need to hit one of our pots so we can draw cards. Cause we are low on cards right now. We need to figure something out here. Um, I don't, I don't even know what to do here. This mirror match is tough. Imperial Order is gonna for sure come down. Like as soon as I can, I'm, I'm gonna activate um, Imperial Order. I think it's good enough. Okay, yeah. So here, we, here goes Imperial Order. Here, we're not gonna let that happen. So he, he's gonna banish. So he he's gonna banish here, which is good. It'll filter out some of his extra deck. They're face down to me, and then now we're gonna go Imperial Order, negating that pot. He can't act with his uh, Eld Elixir either. Not that he had anything in his grave to activate it with. So you already removed from play one of his. Uh, 
wild liches. Two of these are out. She's gonna change that to a special. Doesn't matter. She's gonna set something. I I want to say that I'm in the driver's seat right now just because he's used a lot of his. He's used three already, and well four, and and his and one elder just gone. I want elder gone and one gone. So it depends what I start drawing here. Conquistador. Okay. So he's gonna use the conquistador to destroy my golden land, to destroy my imperial order most likely. So I need to hit an eldritch pretty soon then to destroy his eldritch. Problem is, is if I open Eldritch, let's do this. So we want this in the grave. So we might just put him in a, an attack position. We'll take twenty five hundred if he attacks it, but we will get to go set. So let's put it in attack mode. Hoping that he attacks it and destroys it. It's kind of risky. But I think it's worth it. I'll destroy both of my cards though. Yeah, that's fine. That's, that's what I wanted to do. So we're going to take 2500. That's fine. We're going to take 33. That's fine. So I want him to destroy that. So we need that in our grave to activate its effect. I, I would have liked to have activated it with Eldritch out, but without having an Eldritch in hand or in the grave or anything to search with, I just had to get it down now. At his next opportunity, he's going to activate this back row to pop my Imperial Order. And he goes, and he's just hitting his his searches, and I'm not hitting any of mine. I Opening double Lava Golem. And pot has just been so bad for me. Golden land forever. That's not good. So he has his counter. So he can pitch his old bitch. Counter whatever I do. Skill drain. Will probably be countered. Take 700. I might lose this mirror match. Just because I'm not hitting anything that I actually need. Which really blows. So now we activate this card. She can't counter right now because it's not on the field. But he can chain to it. Yeah, that's what I assumed he was going to do. So he should destroy my Imperial Order. But I think it's going to happen here. Because he's going to do this here to counter, pitching this, especially it back with the spell card. So let's go get. So we don't have an Elder Turn Grave. So we have to go set this one. Once we do it, he's going to go and counter it, most likely. So we want him to counter this. Because if we still go to Grave, we're going to banish it later to set something else. And then go to Skull Drain. That will stop his effects from activating. Dang, he's has, he has such a better board state than I do. I've hit nothing that I actually need. Like, double Lava Golem. How, how am I hitting double Lava Golem? In my opening hand. When, I, I, when there's only two Lava Golems in this deck. That's where... Like, I opened up a bad hand to play against this. Let's see what he has. So he knows that I, I'm gonna, I have to do Elixir. He knows that. So let's do that. She should counter, but if he counters it, he has to pitch that to the grave. So to stop his attack. Oh, that's a zombie as well? I didn't know that Guardian was a zombie. Okay, so that didn't work out the way we wanted to. So we're going to take in 25. 
Do I lose here? Two thousand twenty-five. I'm gonna have eight hundred. Oh, I didn't know that this was a zombie. I really don't know what I can draw here that would save this game for me. There really isn't anything at all. So if I draw Eldritch, it doesn't do anything. He's gonna go get an Elixir, of course. God, dude, I've I've had such bad draws. So we're gonna do pot. Just gonna banish six and hit all three of our super dreadnought cannons. So that's not great. I'm going to chain this in the grave. This game isn't done yet. It's not done yet. Come back from worse. Because now we're on the offensive now. Now we can get out our defenders. Two cards here. Okay, so we're gonna go reasoning. Uh, what does he have? Does he have his own Imperial Order? Does he have another counter? This is a zombie as well. And he's gonna say level 10. There's a solemn judgment. Goes in match. Okay, so Paleozoic, we kind of needed that. See, I, I want these Eldritch cards in my grave. Because now I can summon them. Now, now I can actually use them in my graveyard. Hit both of my reasonings in my third Paleozoic, Golden Land, Summon Limit, my third Skill Drain, my Old Elixir, Pot of Prosperity. Bro, where are my Old Liches at? Jeez. Wow. This is not great. And we mill through about 20 cards there. We have three cards left in deck. It's not the best. But now we get to activate our Outlitch. So we'll... I really don't want to pitch this skill drain, but I mean, it's not like he can do anything really. He can summon an old lich, but I can summon my old lich now. Unless he has something to negate this. I should get this swing on his old lich. I, um, I don't know if I want to though. I think I should just hit this. Hit his conquistador. I, I, I can get a lot of sets in my end phase. I can try and build up a defense here. So we're gonna move to combat. <clears throat> I don't want his Eldritch, I want his trap. He can set if he wants to, that's fine. He can special if he wants to. If he has, what is this? You take damage equal, if he's attacking him on attack, you banish that monster. Your opponent's next turn to that monster inside the field. Wow, that is not something that I expected. Um. So we're gonna do two Paleozoics here. Get our defenders out. So he's gonna take 3,500 here, regardless. We're gonna get to set two defenders. Oh, I don't get to set my other one. Okay, that's not great. So we are going. So he's gonna get our Eldritch the start of his next turn isn't great and two of ours are now banished we have one left and three cards in deck dude his his deck feels a lot I mean also he hit more of his cards than I did I didn't hit nearly close to what I needed so we're gonna hit all of these
He's in a special, another Eldritch. Which is great. I'm gonna go here. If he has a, a Super Dreadnought Cannon, then it's pretty much game here. Which sucks that we lost his mirror match. But I think we lost it because we, we hit a bad hand. Also, we freaking completely whiffed on, all, on a lot of our stuff. I think the only thing that saves here is a Torrential Tribute, but... Um, two in our grave, we might have one left. But two cards and one is an Eldritch. Uh, this isn't looking great. No card in deck, of course. Why don't you make some normal deck? Um, I'm not very good at building decks. It's a pussy deck. Well, it is what it is. I don't play Yu-Gi-Oh like that. A friend built this for me, so I'm using it. You can hate if you want. I don't care. So he's gonna get our El Lich, which, which sucks. So let's just get our defenders out. Hmm. Yeah, that I can fucking fuck off. He can get reported. I don't need haters on here. Okay, so we have three defenders. Hmm. This is interesting. If he has, if he has a super dreadnought, then he wins a game here. Yeah, I think that's what he has. Xyz. Yeah, that's game. Damn, dude. Alright, back in it. We drop to gold 5 from gold 4. I understand the hate for this deck because I do play other card games but this is a one-on-one -on -one game like you should always play to win and I think that's what I'm doing with this deck so I don't really care what people say bro why am I opening another lava golem dude like why how am I opening this card three straight duels Come on, give me an Eldritch early. Nah, that was Imperial Order. Oh man, Reasoning really screwed us last game. And I think it's gonna do it again this game. Eldland, there goes Elixir. Another Elixir. My second Eldland. There he goes, finally. We get our Elvich out. After milling 14 cards. Perfect. So let's do this. Set our golden land. Let's do this. Yes, Conquistador. Okay, so... I think we're good there. We can get our second outlet with this trap. Fast turn there. Let's see what he does. And now in step, we can go activate again. Vaquero, we can go do... 
this one as well. The pitching both of those gives us two more sets. So let's set another elixir. Can pitch that next turn. So I'm not really worried about that. And we get this spell as well. We have a full five back row now. It's perfect. And he just scoops. Okay. Sweet. Oh yeah, Dark Fire Soldier. I love that they gave us these old cards that no one uses. Another gold five player. They get to decide. I really don't understand the hate for Elixir. I understand that it's a control deck, so people won't like it. But I mean, it's a way to play the game, though. If it was like a 4v4, like a like a Fatal 4-Way, like in Commander, where it's, where it's a 4-Way, like free-for-all, then I understand playing control is very, um, people don't like it a lot. But in a one-on-one -on -one game, I feel like you should be able to play the way that you want to. So this guy coming into the comment section and saying that this deck's a pussy deck. Well, I don't give a damn. You can say what you want. Hmm, so what's this here? Prank Kids. I've not played Prank Kids before, so this is interesting. So it might be an early stream today, though. Um... I really um I really do want to play um some it might be the show before I head out to play magic. So I'm going to play magic tonight. Let's see. Thursday, what is Thursday? Um, hmm. See, specials a shit ton. Prank kids, do dodo doodle do. Hmm. Hmm. <sighs> Just keeps recycling cards back into his deck. Twenty one, thirty one, thirty five, nine, nine, forty six. Three, six, seven, eleven, thirty-one. So forty-one cards in the deck. We we run. I'm pretty sure. Pretty sure this is forty only. Let's figure this out though. Let's see what he does. Lampsies. So these things are just gonna keep special summoning a shit ton. For Maxi, really would have been great. This is his fourth summon already, fifth maybe. Not to mention he's already played three, four, four spells or traps, three cards in hand. This Link Monster, seven cards in grave already. And he specials back from his grave somehow. Now it is his turn. And he gets to just shuffle back into deck. Recycling his cards, drawing a card. This deck is, it seems really good. 
It seems like he's, he used to just keep doing shit. So let's go part of extravagance. Do you have anything for this? So we're gonna banish six. Super dreadnought there. Okay, we have one, two dreadnoughts still. Okay, so we banish one, two, three, four, five. And probably just this as well. Unless he has something for this. Ash Blossom. Nope. Okay. Okay, so. Um, what are we going to do here? Eldland. Let's see what he has. What is he going to do? Maxi, maybe. Ash Blossom, maybe. Does, do these have effects he can do? So he can do this. That dude's comment really pissed me off. Why don't you make some normal deck? Bitch, none of these decks in Yu-Gi-Oh are fucking normal. Bitch, you're all fucking crazy. So he's adding two. Curse Eldland. Dang. The fact that he has six cards in hand, six cards on field, one card in grave, still 18 cards in his deck. It's absolutely nuts. It's honestly really. Insane that he has this much stuff. Okay, so we're going to add this for sure. Okay, so now so let's activate this. And we're gonna send our pots, we can't use it this turn anyways. We're gonna destroy He has so much stuff up though, It's it, I don't even know what to destroy. Let's see where the field spell, I think that's the most important one here. He does have two back row. They're probably traps. But we can wait for now. Cause we're gonna go. Set here. We're gonna special Eldritch. He stops this, it's whatever. We have plenty of options in hand still. So we're gonna get Eldritch, special Eldritch. <clears throat> 3500 can be destroyed by card effects. Active Eldritch effect. this infinite permanence
But still has to be pitched, so that's all that really matters. Are we gonna send the elders to the grave? So negating its effects doesn't really bother me. Um, so we're gonna go here. We're gonna go here. And Vanny's emptiness as well. We're gonna keep this to pitch with Paleozoic, and then we'll go to battle. So I can't be sure about card effects now. I was surprised to see this uh, infinite permanence. So it's the first time that I've actually seen it in the game. He uses a hand trap as well. I didn't know that. Okay, yeah. So we're gonna battle. Attack this link here. Fifteen hundred to him. Um, keeping this in hand, that's for sure. We'll go with there. Nothing to banish as of right now. Jail. Jail. Mike. Mike. Jail tonight. So in response to that, we're going to. Um. So we have to order this right. We have to order this right. So Vanny's enemies is we're gonna activate first. But before that. Damn, I think we might have fucked up there. Maybe we don't do Golden Land then. Yeah, so we're gonna do Elixir. Before Emptiness activates. And then we're gonna Paleozoic as well. On its field spell. He scoops, let's go, let's go, baby. I think he needed his full spell to, to do what he wanted to do. Play a better deck. I know, right? I'm such a I'm I'm such a try hard playing this deck. People hate on people are hating on me. For no damn reason. Dude that I just came to the chat was like, You're playing a pussy deck. For no reason. Black Wings? Do you want to play Black Wings? I, th I think they're going to get smoked though. Where is it at? Oh, ghetto Black Wings. I feel like this deck gets smoked though. It's the thing. Alright, we'll do a Black Wing duel and then. We're in the stream there. That dude pissed me off. Also, I, I want to go play the show now. Oh, we're in a second. Gold one player, okay. Got a body here now. Should have been like one v one me. <laughs> Others are fairly boring, boring to watch. I think they're boring if you don't. I don't find it boring just because I don't play Yu Gi Oh. Like it's my first time playing in like ten years. 
So it's still like interesting to me. So that's the reason why I don't find it boring. Because normally I, I do find I do find like trap heavy decks and like counter heavy decks to really be boring in other um games. But in here, not really. Cause it's still so new to me. Oh, it just sucks if we get two tuners out. I'm sure it had something else. Um, material. Um, do we do Strix here? I think we do Strix here. No point having these out if we can't synchro this turn. So let's do that. Spray Raptor. Oh, Ash Blossom. Okay. Nice, nice, nice. Um, let's set this then. And then we'll pass in the turn. We'll, we'll hit him for 14. Then pass the turn. Dang it. Oh, okay. That's not too bad. Yeah. Once you fight against five matches, Eldritch, Dry Town, and Trap Grave just starts getting incredibly repetitive. Yeah. Uh, I haven't, I've seen Trap Grave, I think, once, and I've seen Dry Tron, Dry Tron, Dry Tron, whatever it's called, maybe two or three times. Um, do we want these? 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 Do we want so do we want to let him XZ's or do we want to just destroy this shit? Um, let's just destroy it right now. Uh, I just don't know what I want to draw. Let's just do it. It's Black Wings. I take risks with this deck. I don't really care about, about playing with this one. And then that gets activated. He brings one back. Well, he'll take a thousand damage and he'll lose. Zero zero as well. Okay, and it's turn. Do you think we can just play this 100 attack and destroy that? But I, oh no. Okay, so we do have this. Okay, let's go. Oh, we don't have a black wing though. We don't have a black wing. What do we have here? What, what, what can we do here? Uh, does not help us at all. I need a black wing creature, and I don't have one. Oh no. Um. It's because if, if if I if I attack with this, then that just comes back. <laughs> it just doesn't make no sense to attack it. But yeah, I mean, since 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 I'm since I'm so new into the new like Yu-Gi-Oh like archetypes and stuff, like seeing these decks, it, it's more like, like like I haven't seen them before. So like I don't see it like that. I don't see it as like oh it's boring. It because it's something for me to learn more of. This is a really bad play, I think, but let's just destroy it, and then he'll, he'll just bring it back again, but it's whatever. It's kind of dumb that it just loops itself like that, though. Like, like you have to kill it twice in the same turn for it to not loop anymore. But he is taking damage, though. Um, I don't really need West Challenge right now. Dang it, I need a Blackwing creature, man. And I mean, like my er the the area when I play Yu Gi Oh is like synchros and XZs, so like that's why like, I made this like Blackwing deck. Cause it's pretty cool. Uh, let's insert some ones card. Extra deck. So XZs. He's gonna let's go XZs something right now. <clears throat> but I mean, I think since I started playing Magic this year, well last year. So like I've been playing Magic now for a whole year. Seeing new stuff is always a lot of fun to, for me. I, I I think it's really fun. Uh, we'll, we'll see what I do. They detach. Okay, yeah. So that's um, Sash Blossom. But yeah, since I started playing Magic, um, 
I I I I feel like seeing really strong stuff is honestly a lot of fun. It it opens up things. It lets you see new things. The the meta and magic's something else as well, but I mean it is what it is. And Zeus, of course, so everyone does that after they attack with the next Z's monster. Okay, so how do I do this? I'm gonna banish Bora. Sadly, Black Whirlwind. Summon some Moon. We need to add more. So we do get another normal summon. And then he's gonna wipe the board. Yep. That's rough. See, this is why I don't play Black Wings. It's, you play against this and it just doesn't do anything. It sucks, but it is what it is. Let's just play Witch Counters. Wow, Zeus just ended this game for me. That's nice. But yeah, I feel like if I'm playing Eldritch here, this this matchup, I think this is an easy matchup to win. Like, there's not much going on with this deck that I can't stop with Eldritch. But Black Wing's a little too weak for it. Because he just shut down my whole combo with one card. Um, okay, so I do get something here. A trap card. So he has priority for something. So he has something he can activate over there. So we'll get a creature back. Um, can be sort of a battle. Probably Gale. Do we bring back? I don't know. Level four lower monster. Yeah. I assume Gale is probably the one to bring back. Hoping that we can hit a non-tuner on our next draw. <clears throat> so we, 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 we hit a level 4 here. That's all I can really think. And Palazoic. Oh my god. Damn it. Well, that's what happens when you don't play meta game. Damn it, dude. That pisses me off. All right, let's do it again. I will say there, there definitely should be uh, like non-ranked mode because it's not, it's not fun dropping in rank when. You're trying to play a fun deck. Hmm. Okay, so this, this is a lot better opening hand. I didn't hit any fucking black wings in that first hand. That's why. Uh, oh, great. So, we're going to do this. Stop this shit right now. <clears throat> Okay, so we stop that. Come on, give me some moon right here. Oh, I will take that as well. Although, these aren't really the best cards to have. Um, it's bottomless. Black whirlwind. Austere Blizzard. I think Blizzard's probably the move here. Oh, Maxi. Just great. That's special summon though, right? Yeah, okay. So that doesn't really bother me. So we're gonna summon... I think Blizzard's probably the one I go here. Because I need to get something that can special. 
So if we do six there, or could do ten. Yeah. So it's okay. So let's do uh, austere. So he's at most going to draw one card. Well, two actually. Oh, does he have a fucking ash blossom? So then, why do you max C then? There's no point to max C then if you're going to ash blossom it. That don't make no sense. Okay. Okay. So I guess we just pass there. No, that didn't make no sense. Why do you max C and ash blossom? So you, you just pitch your max C for nothing. Put magic on console, please. Fuck this game. Oh, he's just scooped, I guess. All right. Oh, it's a black wing win. These, these are not being good hands with, with these black wings deck though. <clears throat> I I I I I will say though, the 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 Yu-Gi-Oh community on Twitter and on YouTube, they feel very um biased. They don't want you to play all the good stuff, but when they play it, they wanna like they want to feel all high and mighty when, when they play it though so that is something that I've noticed they'll judge you for playing old lich hey maxi that's fine um inventory uh, I don't care about anything else fuck these people you know you know how, how I am Oh, I'm really gonna add. Yeah, we do wanna add that actually. So he did play Maxi. Hmm. Do we wanna let him draw two cards here? Cause we can special this for free. Or we can special this. Activate effect. Can we go for 10? Yeah, we can actually. Okay, so we're gonna special here. He can take his fucking card draw. Fuck him. He becomes a 6. And then we're gonna go for 10. He can draw two cards. That's fine. Mike, do this, Mike. Full armor master, let's go, baby. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Draw your fucking cards, bro. We're gonna keep this the picture for twin twisters. Set this. Oh, was, we went first. I didn't even fucking realize we actually went first. All right, we're gonna turn there. Cyber Dragon. I'm gonna play a Cyber Dragon deck. Okay. Cyber Low Fusion. Okay. That's not good. Um, um, that's not good. Do we bottom this right now? I, I think we do. Kills them both. 
Unless you have to counter for that. Well, is there one? Is there a hand trap you can activate? Does he have something for this? Like, can he react to it? I don't think so. Let's go! Fuck them cyber dragons. Ugh, what is this now? Is he doing it again? Um. It's not great. What the fuck is this? Any freaking spell cards. Where are the spells at? Trap cards, spells, anywhere? This has, this has been creatures. Luckily we banished this two Star Dragons. Well, I didn't think he's gonna be able to special like this, bro. Holy shit. Where's my Maxi at? Special fucking four five creatures. And then has no exe shit, bro. I was not expecting this. Cyber Dragon Infinity. Now what does this do? Where are you spilling trap cards at? Damn it, dude. One face. Wow. So that's kind of broken. You tell me people complain about this shit out here, and then this and there's decks like this happening. Come on, man. Look at this shit. That shit's a fucking onboard counter for everything. This dude on special summon like fucking ten times this turn already. Y'all, y'all, y'all want to bitch me up about playing L liches when shit like this is going on? Hell no. Nah. Motherfuckers tripping. Let me get my twin twisters. Play a trap card. Shit. I think this Yu-Gi-Oh player base has a problem. Cause this is out of hand. And I ain't seen no one complain about this shit. So what does this do? Her name from Star Dragon and his top face. Yeah, we're I think we lost this duel already. I think there's an L. Um, it's kind of BS.
<clears throat> yeah, this is an L. The fact that I bought him this trap hold two cyber dragons and he was still able to get all this shit out doesn't make any sense to me. Sure, just to fucking do it. This is horrible. Literally. Like, what the fuck is going on? Like... What the fuck, dude? Like, how the fuck? Yeah, that was some bullshit. Banish two Cyber Dragon still gets out. Four special summons. What the fuck is that, bro? I don't want to see no one playing, playing fucking Eldritch. Not in this chat. Take that shit somewhere else. Oh, we're not editing. We're changing decks. Sky Strikers, okay. Imperial Orders, Summon Limits. That was probably the worst experience of my fucking life, bro. Bro, can I stop drawing this fucking lava golem, bro? Holy shit. Why do I keep seeing this card when I don't need it? My Zeus, that's not great. Oh, what does he have? He has something. Adding a Lich. Hmm. 
Hmm. So we're gonna. Um, I don't do toads right now. We fucking play. I'm mad. Okay, let's calm down. Let's figure this out. Because we need to. Let's pitch. I get torrents with tribute. Let's hit his back row. Let's hit his back row. Is this an old lecture deck too? What? I was not going to hit that <laughs> that freaking spell card there. I was really not expecting that. Nice time. You down. Nice time. No, no, no. So we're gonna do this, this, material order for sure, because he, he wants to activate spell cards, so, I mean, they, they were just gonna negate it, but he wants them in his grave, I guess. Move to combat. Alright, gotta, gotta decompress. Gotta, gotta, gotta reinvigorate myself, because I'm like ticked off. I'm like tilted right now for no reason. <laughs> that sky just keeps fucking splashing itself. That's not cool. Round it. So we need to banish that shit then. My style drag you down. Sky strike him. Now we're gonna imperial order. We're gonna. We're gonna summon them it. Conquistador as well. So we're going to. Trigger or that. No sir, no spell cards. I have no problem doing this. No sir. Lifestyle drag you down. And the last time you found. Uh, 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 uh.
so we're gonna go here. My damn go. Mm -mm -mm -mm. I'm gonna go summon them at two. Don't activate that until we get our Eldritch out. Let's bring Eldritch to the field now. They get to attack directly though. So I wanna, when he attacks. He can keys the door, destroy it. It's a special that thing back. Fucking Ray, whatever. Yeah, Sky Tracker is Ray. 24 7. 24 hours. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Sky. Destroy that. Don't, you don't get to battle. You special that back, but you kind of special it again. It's gonna be your second summon. Know you're live. God's not finished. Live. God's not finished. God's not finished. No, God's not in it. Now we in it. In it. Hero. <laughs> Do you have an Elvish then? Does he have Elvish? I'm interested to see if he does. And I assume he does. Hmm, be okay. We gonna be okay. Be okay. Be okay. Okay, so let's activate this first. Set a card. Destroy that card. So I finished. God's not finished. God's not finished. Not finished. So, cause I, I don't want to destroy these when I set them. That's a thing. But I do. Let's do Hakero then. You know what? Let's just fuck it. Let's just do one of these. I don't want to, but I think I have to. So I, want, I need to keep Imperial Order up. I need to keep summoning them up. So we're gonna get our, our first summon of this turn. We're gonna pitch our back row face down. Oh, we could have pitched that. I fucked up. Fuck! Fuck, dude. I fucked up. Oh. Oh, I fucked up. Oh, shit. Oh, here comes an Eldritch. It's to destroy something. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Banish a card is gonna banish my old lich. No. Yeah, I mean I'm gonna lava ball on him. Cause he's a bitch. Lava Golem to goes in match, I think is probably the move here. The Hikaru or the Sky Striker? See, he wants this in his grave. But I mean, this actor is in the grave too, so it only really matters. Bitch ass dude, we thought he was doing something, huh? He thought he thought we was just playing today, huh? Bitch ass dude. Skirt, 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 skirt. 
ditch that. Let's go get this so you can special another Eldritch. So he's limited to two summons per turn. He can't activate any spell cards. He can only have one attribute of monster now as well. So he's gonna take a thousand damage. So we're gonna go. We don't want to get Eldritch out yet. I don't want to activate Ghost and Mesh yet either. I want to see if he moves this to attack position. He should move it to attack position. He's gonna go. Yeah, he's gonna go. <sighs> Pitch that. What's he gonna set? It should be a spell or a trap. It should be the trap card. Either Hikaru or Rocky, uh, Conquistador. I'm take a thousand damage. Pure order hits me. Main phase. So we, we need to stop from getting an Eldritch out. So this is where we're going to chain Gozen match. Stopping it. So soon, you. So he shouldn't be able to summon it. He shouldn't be able to. So that should stop the special summon of the Eldritch. I'm pretty sure. So soon, not for you. Does he still get to? I just pitched it. Oh, <laughs> okay, okay. You're gonna want. So you want the pre order gone? He's gonna pitch the lava golem. Interesting now. I mean, it's two. Just add one Sky Striker card from deck to his hand. We got three more spells in graveyard. You can draw one card. So he shouldn't be able to draw, but he should be able to add to hand. Oh, you said. Do I have an Eldritch in my grave? No, I don't. So that doesn't do anything for me. Oh, no! So let me chain response to that, right? Gets rid of my Gozen match somehow. Oh, I see why. He wasn't able to summon again. At least I don't think he was. So he needs that in my grave. So we're going to pull the one from my grave. I think that's how it's going to work. I'm going for game this turn. I have to. Okay, that doesn't really help me right now. So he has one in grave. He has one. No, he has. So he has two in deck then. Damn it. This is hard, dude. Since he took out that fucking Imperial Order, fucked me up.
That's dumb, bro. That shit is so dumb. Because he activates in response to me. Oh, fuck. That's so fucking dumb. Can't even do anything here now. To banish my own fucking Eldritch, and that's my last one. Oh, well, I just in turn. Fuck, dude. That Imperial Order, I needed that shit to stay out. And he has so many ways to get his Eldritch out, though. It's the thing that's fucking me up. Sure, one face of corn the field. So he's gonna destroy first. Ah, oh, shit. He's gonna special on Eldritch. I think I fucking lost, bro. Fuck, dude. I think it's an L. I really think it is. These cards are just dead cards, I'm having more Eldritches. He just gets to keep recycling his fucking Sky Striker cards too. That's some bullshit. He just goes and does the same thing if I remove them from the field I can't get to a Zeus I can't get to a Dreadnought he just will keep recycling this fucking Sky Strike and mobilize Do this. We need to destroy ours. I can't even activate Paleozoic. I don't have a card in my hand. He's gonna get an Eldritch back to his hand. He's getting special, I'm pretty sure. Yep. Response. Unless he goes super, he, unless he destroys, no, he would, unless he goes, uh, super dreadnought, destroys here for 500, activates effect, does another 2000, and goes for Zeus, wipes board. Oh, but he can't special again, I don't think, because he's special with this elixir this turn. Right? Yeah, see, so that's his third summon now. So he doesn't have any more summons this turn. As long as summon limits on the field. So what's he gonna do here? Yeah, he's gonna destroy mines, farm. I can just bring it back next turn. Oh. Well, yeah, that's fine. God, he still has shit to do with his grave? Fuck. I have two in my grave still. Golden land forever. Oh. I think this is game then. Golden Knight Forever out.
damn, bro. This shit is fucking me up. He has two Eldritches, too. Oh. Fuck, how do I do this? I can't activate this still. Fuck. I think I have to set this and just pass turn, I think. Because if I go to summon, it'll just negate it. But it's not going to negate this. I think Golden Land is probably the play here. Counter is counter. <laughs> okay, I think that's all I can do here. <clears> Heart <throat> two. <sighs> You destroy my old lich. Oh, he destroyed a sky striker. Oh no, he tributes his sky striker. Kagari. Oh, he destroyed my summon limit. He, he thinks he's going for game here then. That's what he thinks is happening. I think I can somehow win this game. If I Solemn and Golden Man in the right order, I should win this game. I do have an Eldritch in my grave to bring out with Elixir. Fuck, dude. Um, do we saw him strike that? I think we do, because he would just banish my Eldritch. So I think he should golden land this, but then I'll golden land his golden land, tributing my old lich, and then special get back with uh, with old elixir. Can I not chain that? Okay, yeah, not chain it with my own. So that way the song doesn't get negated. So I, I negate his golden land. So his golden eyes and activate, so my solemn activates. Get rid of that. And then I have El Elixir I can activate. I'm pretty sure he can activate on his turn. Quick play spell, right? He's gonna send this to the grave. Uh, I think I still lose then. I think he still gets out a. Uh... I think he can still get back in Elixir with this card, this face down. It'll let him summon one from my grave, which is an Elixir. I'll banish this, yeah. I'm gonna destroy this. I think, th I think I lost. Fuck, dude. Oh 
Holy shit. He's going double Sky Striker Mecha. Gonna get rid of one. Oh, that's game. Yep. Fuck, dude. Every play. Casual. <laughs> this guy. Casual. Spurs deck. Pot of Avarice. Rhoda. I guess Sky Striker. Control. This is a lot different from the deck that I run. He has no XDs either. It's only just Sky Strikers. It's a rare. It's an ultra. An ultra. I think I have an Axis Coat Talker, so. Borlo Dragon. I have a uh, Borlo Sword. Firewall Dragon. Geonator Transverser. Hmm. What does he have to his fusion? I don't get it. What, what does he have the fusion with? Nigeru. Now look at the fucking rarities in this deck. It's almost all ultras and, and supers. All right, gentlemen. We're in the stream here. Gonna chill for a bit. I play some MLB the show. Well. I will see y'all back later. Uh, probably tomorrow we'll be back on with, with another stream. Catch you later.